All right, yo, what is up? This is just gonna be a quick tutorial on how to add a white background to your renders in Twin Motion. I had somebody ask me how to do this, and this is just kind of a quick fix that I found. I don't know if it's the best way, but it's kind of the way that I do it for now until I find another way. All right, so basically what you wanna do is go over here, make sure this is popped out. Uh, right click, create new sub container and just call it white background um, once that's done you want to go to your library go to objects primitives and any one of these planes should do because you can always like resize it depending on your scene All right. So you just kind of want to put it up vertical. You can rotate it as well if you don't have a, a plane to place it on. And then you just kind of slide it just in the background a little bit. It will like block a little bit of light. So just kind of like make sure that wherever it's at in your view, that light can still get in. All right. So there you go. Um, now that that's there. Now what I do next is, I'll just go to the more tab after you select this little media button over here where you like made your photos go to weather and then I kind of just add in or go to season right here and then just kind of like add in snow And then once that's like that, go back to the image tab and then just kind of hide everything that's outside. Make sure you reload so it saves this, uh, the settings. And there you have it. It's basically rendered with the white background. And to actually render it, just go to export, click the image, select the one you want. I'm gonna boost the exposure just a little bit. And there you have it. Your render now has a white background and there are lots of sirens outside. So with that, I'll end this tutorial. Until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Bye.